staying with us this midday right now at 12:30. We continue to follow breaking news out of Newport News where police are investigating a bank robbery that led to a chase and a crash involving a police officer. Now, investigators say the robbery happened at Bayport Credit Union on Warwick Boulevard just after 9:45 this morning. The chase ended on the interstate just a short time later. Our Maria Elena Balores is on the scene near where the accident happened. Maria Elena yeah, Don, like you said, the chase ended on the interstate, but here on Jefferson Avenue and Roger Brown Drive, a police car was involved in an accident, and that police car has been towed away since then. Nobody was injured. And like you also mentioned, this all started back at a Bayport Credit Union on Warwick Boulevard earlier this morning. Police say that a man entered the bank, demanded money, was given that money, and then left. Newport News police found the car that that man was in. They say multiple other suspects were inside of the car as well. They tried to stop the car, but the car would not stop. So Newport News police and state. It all ended on Interstate 64. Now, police say nobody was hurt during this entire incident. Now, we are still working to learn how many people were inside of that car, an exact number, how many people were detained, and if they face any charges. And like we mentioned earlier, a police vehicle was involved in an accident. We spoke to the driver of the other car that was involved in that accident. You'll hear from him starting on Wavy News 10 at 4 later today. For now, live in Newport News, I'm Maria Elena Belores, 10 on your side.